हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अ वेरी वेरी स्पेशल व्लॉग बाय लाइफ एक्स एंड आई एम डॉक्टर श्रामना गॉन आर द डेज व्हेन कोर एंड स्टीरियोटिपिकल इंजीनियरिंग मेडिकल लॉ एंड एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन वर कंसिडर्ड एज मेन करियर वेज वन कैन पिक टुडे इट इज द एरा टू थिंक आउट ऑफ द बॉक्स टू एक्सप्लोर व्हाट यू लव एंड टू फॉलो योर पैशन एज फॉर एग्जाम्पल आफ्टर फिनिशिंग एम बी बी एस वेन यू बिकम अ डॉक्टर देर आर न्यूमेरस रोड्स ऑफ ऑपरचुनिटीज वेर यू कैन वॉक to rediscover your true potential like you can choose to do post graduation and choose your specialty like i did anesthesiology and became an anesthesiologist similarly there are numerous other great great specialties where amazing work is done for the benefit of mankind and healing our patients similarly in today's world after finishing engineering or btech one doesn't stop there are lots of remarkable study options that one can choose after finishing btech or engineering today we are going to explore one of such very promising career aspect that is studying technical management how studying technical management can entirely change your life and today team life x is having a very very special person with us let me take the pleasure to introduce you to vikram banerji vikram a very talented and youthful person who decided to choose this fascinating challenging and new option of studying technical management from germany after finishing his btech in mechanical engineering as a zeal to prove himself to the world hello and i welcome all the dedicated viewers of life hacks uh, and also to those who have tuned into this channel for the very first time Firstly I would like to thank Shramanadi for giving me this opportunity to come to Life Hacks and speak in front of you. I would like to start off with very basic questions who am I and why am I here today? So I am Vikram Banerjee. Uh let's just stick to my study path and career. Uh I'm studying at University of Applied Sciences Emdenlehr Germany and currently pursuing uh masters of engineering in technical management although it's already um, in the field of stereotypical engineering but i would say technical management uh, has its own uh, speciality it's uh, very unique in its own way uh, it's something new and uh, quite trendy uh, i'm pretty sure uh, not many people are aware of this field and hence i am here to explain it to you what is this all about you can do masters in technical management after earning your bachelor's degree it could open up more potentially rewarding and profitable career opportunities for you but the question arises that what is technical management so what is exactly technical management The study program of technical management aims at providing higher studies to people those who have already got bachelor's degree in uh, engineering uh, preferably in mechanical engineering and sciences while um, this study program is accredited under uh, the department of mechanical engineering so the main motive of uh, technical management uh, is to provide competencies both in the field of technology as well as in the field of business uh, as of to say uh, in uh, many industries rather uh, most of the industries there exists a gap between the business management and the technical feasibilities previously uh, these two departments used to be separate entities independent of each other and thereby um, arising a communication gap uh, the business people couldn't communicate uh, in terms of uh, technical uh, technicalities and also the technical experts couldn't communicate properly in terms of business language so here comes the techno managers the techno managerial field mm, as of to say like us who are studying in the field of technical management here is our role to bridge this gap we are here uh, to bridge the gap between the management and the uh, technical field 
The coursework for this study program blends principles of management, business strategy design and engineering to prepare you to recognize promising technological innovations and oversee development process. Now, let's learn more about the coursework. So, it is needless to say, uh, those who are studying in technical management are provided both technical competencies and economic competencies, uh, such as fundamentals of economy, law and various aspects of management. Contrary to a, a core technical and engineering field in one side and uh, a core business management on the other. And finally, at the end, professionalism, which is very important aspect. In this course, you can learn about theories of business and leadership with an emphasis on managing technical workers and new product development. So, masters in technical management can be invaluable in today's world given the rapidity and also the evolving nature of technology and business in modern era. Vikram, a promising student from the beginning, was also someone who had a great zeal to prove himself to the world. So, why he chose to do technical management? So coming to the question uh, why I really chose technical management is that after studying a bachelor's of engineering in mechanical, um, I got an opportunity to work as a IT professional. So yeah, it's a, a kind of weird that after studying mechanical engineering, you're working as an IT professional, but we are well aware of the placement scenarios back in India it's um, frankly speaking it's not that good so after working for two two and a half years i realized that this is not the place where i belong i really didn't want to continue as an it professional so i wanted to switch back to mechanical sector and what else a place better than germany for mechanical engineers and uh, then uh, back in my mind um, i had a desire to work in a technical field and then gradually move into the management sector and then i found out this course of technical management uh, which was exactly catering to all the needs i had all the requirements and i wasted no time and grabbed the opportunity to study this course for professionals with background in science or engineering this degree can be next step towards leadership role in design or project management here are some names of institutions which offer this course that is technical university of applied sciences wildau brunel university University London, ESCP Business School London. Other names are given in the description box below. Future career aspects of technical management. The future career aspects, uh, the prospects you have after studying this course. So, yeah, one can go in his choice uh, of field. Uh, for example, supply chain management, uh, even business management, business analysis, then even one can go into sales and marketing, then IT systems implementation in logistics, system dynamics in uh, production and logistics, production systems and networks, and um, this list continues. Uh, so there is a there is a rainbow of opportunities and the, all this comes under this massive umbrella of technical management. So if you earned your master's in technical management, you may secure a job as a project manager or you can also pursue executive level position. You can also supervise your technical employees. You can also choose to work as a consultant and advise business on effective technology use or product development. Now let's listen to the pros and cons of this career option. So coming to pros and cons, uh, for pros I can say uh, it gives a boost to your career it gives you a, a career switching opportunity. Um, needless to say, the pay in Western uh, countries like that of Europe is better than India. 
And as I said, as I discussed in the career opportunities, uh, there are numerous numbers of uh, doorways open in front of you. You can choose accordingly in whichever field you want to go. Yeah, and uh, I, I can't uh, recall any um, cons for this course. There are not really uh, much, but yeah, as of this, uh, the, this current situation of ongoing pandemic might be there are a less number of opportunities coming up but i won't say there's none i am still seeing opportunities uh, still seeing uh, requirements uh, being generated in the market so yeah and another thing is that yes you are quite far away from your home from your um, family so yeah, it's a bit difficult, but it depends on your mindset. If you are mentally prepared for this, then that's not going to be a problem at all. You, All you need to do is to prepare your mind beforehand that you are going to stay here, complete your studies, and nothing can come in your way. So, if you are interested in earning this degree, we would suggest you to apply in those universities as we mentioned earlier and give exams overseas. If you wish to earn this degree, nothing is impossible if you work hard. Now, last piece of advice from Vikram regarding this study program of technical management. And... One last piece of advice I want to give to our viewers for those who are currently passing out of school and going to college. Uh, for them, I would say, uh, especially for those who are interested in engineering line, since I am from that background, uh, there's no meaning to taking up anything which you are getting in campus placements unless it's from your academic background. Uh, still, if you want to study core engineering fields like that of mechanical, electrical or civil, then aim for only those premium colleges. Otherwise, there's, I would repeat that there's no meaning to uh, studying something else and uh, ending up working somewhere else. And for those... Mm, who are now interested in coming abroad in doing pursuing bachelors or masters abroad uh, for them i would say it's not that difficult process uh, especially if you are interested in this training field of technical management because uh, many universities are coming up rapidly with this type of courses because it's trending in the market um, not only in europe but also in us you are now going to find this kind of courses so if you are looking for this it's pretty simple you have to give those entry exams and apply to different universities with those scores uh, if i am able to do it then it's not a big deal so it's quite simple uh, you have to just grab the right opportunity at the right time. So that's it from my side. If you like this video, please press the like button. And if you have any further questions, uh, you can comment down below. And maybe Shramanadi or I can get back to you directly in the comment section. And for providing so many informative videos, please don't forget to subscribe to life hacks thank you see you on the other side thank you so much vikram for giving your valuable time and encouraging our viewers to explore such great area of study and career option let's push our boundaries let's try things a little different and difficult that will demand a lot of hard work but will surely give you a great career and future. Let's keep growing, keep shining and keep adding more feathers to your hat of wisdom. Thank you for watching this video. Please press the like button, share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to never miss a video from us. Thank you. Take care of your health. Stay happy, healthy and motivated. See you soon.